For Bethlehem's Christians, Midnight Mass was the highlight in an otherwise dreary Christmas. The town where Christians believe Jesus was born is under Israeli control for the first time since 1994. Israel says it has no choice but to occupy Bethlehem. The government says Palestinian extremists use the town as a base to plan attacks on Israelis. In protest at the occupation, Bethlehem town leaders have cancelled Christmas festivities. Only the religious ceremonies have been left intact. For the second year in a row, Israel banned the Palestinian leader Yasser Arafat from attending Midnight Mass. The government says he's done nothing to stop Palestinian attacks against Israel. An empty chair draped with an Arabic headdress symbolized the absent leader. Although Arafat is a Muslim, he participated regularly since 1995. The Roman Catholic Patriarch of Jerusalem, Michel Saba, prayed for Arafat's welfare. He called for an end to the violence and for Israeli steps to ease tensions. On Christmas Day, there were no decorations adorning Manger Square in front of the Church of the Nativity. Only a small number of worshippers attended morning mass in the church. Most Palestinian Christians spent Christmas Day at home alone, and two years of tension and violence have kept foreign pilgrims away. Meanwhile, Christians in Gaza also attended a morning mass, but again, festivities were minimal. For Christians in the Holy Land this year, Christmas has not been a happy time. 